Hello. 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 Hi, I'm Simon Pegg. I play Sean in the film. Kate Ashfield, I play Liz. I'm Nick Frost, I play Ed. <laughs> Lucy Davis, I play Diana. I'm Dylan Moyne and I play David. <laughs> and here we are with the logos. <laughs> <laughs> Studio Canal, of course. French. French company. Canal with a studio. <laughs> Big studio with a canal running through it. Let's draw some egg. Opening up with what track, Kate? I don't know. Just say it. What, ta- what song's this? <laughs> <laughs> Special Town by For the those ghosts. who don't know, Kate is from the 18th century. <laughs> <laughs> Scariest shot in the film. Oh, Simon. And we begin. Now, this was when we were, um, this is about six weeks into the shoot, I think, and we were in Ealing Studio. That's right, very hot. <laughs> Extremely hot. Okay, what do you, you make of your eye makeup there? <laughs> 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 Looks like there's quite a lot now. Quite a lot it? of slap. Mm. <laughs> now, I was saying to Eggie oh. yesterday, it's really nice the way this scene unfolds because he kind of brings everybody into it one by one and then, then everyone goes out one by one. Yeah. Uh, Would have been horrendous had we all five appeared just at once. Appeared at once. Yeah. <laughs> Big faces. <laughs> Difficult times. I love that pa- I can't stop using the word exacerbate now. <laughs> it's really bugging me. It's a good word. Yeah. Mm. Where, do you, where do you use it? <laughs> when I feel that things are becoming worse. There they oh, are. there am I. Or as Edgar said yesterday, go. Britney Spears and Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind that. Yeah, I'm delighted. <laughs> Did you like the saying, <laughs> Nick? Uh, no, not really. It's not my thing. Yeah. Really? Not really my thing, swearing. Oh, yeah. Friends. I kind of wish I hadn't persisted quite so hard in wearing the hat. I don't know, it makes you look like a sort of Georgie Girl-style character. Uh, What's he? As if you'd, you just walked through swinging London with a record bag. It looks like you're in hey, <laughs> several girl. different bands. Several? <laughs> yeah. All <laughs> playing different music. You look like a pop scarecrow. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go back to Britney Spears. <laughs> oh. Sure, what I'm trying to say is... Did you have to do many throws of me to get <coughs> right, Nick? Yeah. Remember? Yeah, we did quite a few, I think, didn't we? It's one of those films as well where the, g- the girls are conspicuously good looking and the blokes all look like blokes. <laughs> yeah. It's like, how the hell do these guys get these great gals? <laughs> <laughs> do, you, uh, do, do, we, do we remember anything from these days? Do you remember these days, Kate? Yes, I do. <laughs> Great we comment. weren't <laughs> as yet. <laughs> we weren't as yet fed up with the pub because it was our first day, wasn't it? It was our first day in the pub. We did mm. this, and we all we started to get a bit <laughs> crotch rot. Yeah, we got crotch rot bad. <laughs> I think it would have been nice if we'd done it the other way round. Oh, we got the studio out of the way and then spent four weeks in the sunshine. Really yeah, because it got very hot, didn't when it? When was the sunshine? When when did that happen? I think before, didn't it? It was very hot, and then it rained a lot. It was hot when we were at Ealing. Like when we did shot that film in Rangoon. It was hot That's and it right, rained yeah. a lot. <laughs> There's uh, us, Nick. <laughs> Get lost. That's Maury, my partner, there with what? the furry oh, hood on. Is. Oh, is that the back of her head? Yeah, that's the back of her head. I didn't know that. And there's we... Nicola, who you see later on as Mary. Oh, yeah. Naira, or...? Now there's the... There's Naira there. Yeah, she's, yeah, she's there. Yeah, she's there. All never... those people become zombies. We never said in the pub scene that sat behind Kate was um, Edgar's... Patricia. Girlfriend's mum. That's right. Oh, yeah. yes, that's right. Patricia Franklin. <coughs> He's in it quite a lot. There's Gavin. He's very good at football. <laughs> very good. He's very good at keepy uppy. Kate's just offering me a Ricola. Which I think I'll enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> it's like oh, a herb tune. Oh, Simon, your feet. There. There's my I don't feet. Know that... Tastes like nettles. But anyone like a, a sweet? No. No, thanks. No. I love your, I've always loved your feet. Now, you, oh, guys are, you guys are gone by now, because this was the last week of shooting and we were in the uh, was it? in the flat and you guys had all left and there was nobody to sleep on the was crash mat anymore. Was this on set then? Was this on set? Yeah. Or mm-hmm. like Do you remember we used to go into the Studio One at lunchtimes and we'd sit and read and smoke and... Lay on the crash mat. Smoke. Lay on the crash mat. No, you didn't read either. I, I smoked and I read. <laughs> you smoked and <laughs> I sleep. And we all Andrew. lay on the crash mat. And yeah. Kate wandered around with her phone. And every day I bought another pillow in I don't think that's true. <laughs> <laughs> I hate, I hate looking at people brush their teeth. I know, you get yeah. something through me. I hate Especially it when they force yeah. you. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh. There he is, Pete Serafinowitz. Do you not like it? The no. big guy. You don't like the sound of it, do you? No. No, he doesn't like the sweet. Oh, really? I think Pete is going to get... He's definitely going to get offered a Bond villain. 
Ooh, he has yeah. already played, of course, he's the voice of Darth Maul in the mm. Star Wars film. Oh, I think really? Roger Moore would be of a good course. Bond. <laughs> yeah, you should you knew that, didn't you? You got that written in your diary. If they can't get... Um, there was a funny line we cut out here about sleeping with a fat girl. Judy Jones. <gasps> well, I'm glad you cut it out. Did you? Yeah, yeah so am I. I think there's a lot of anti-fat sentiment around. What was the line? It's not anti-fat, he just said he slept with a fat Well, he's not supposed to be a nice character. Oh, oh get off my back. Someone tell me the line, <laughs> I don't know it. He said, I did a lot of silly things at college. I, I drunk snake bite in black, I dressed up as Frank and Furth and I slept with a fat girl. Doesn't mean I want to do any of them. Anyway. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. It's very... Very. You've worked with Pete, haven't you, Dylan? On I've worked with Pete. And, uh, and, uh, and, and Black Books as well. Yeah, and he's not the fat girl. Fran. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, he's, he's got a great set of vocals. Nick? Mm. Oh. This is quite weird, because this was right towards the end of the shoot, and we were very tired at this point. <coughs> when you'd all gone, so it had gone a bit quiet and weird. Yeah. Because it was fun when it was all of us together, because we used to have a bit of a laugh, didn't we? Yeah, play so, a few games. No. No. <laughs> he used to always leave campus and come back with, with presents. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. he'd expensive come Italian with, chocolate. He'd come back with expensive mm. chocolate and bags of books for us all. <laughs> oh. so I did it once. Twice. Twice. Did I? And we all went and got lots of coffee, didn't we? Oh, we used to do coffee runs and uh, they spend hated up us. to two. Well, the budget went. Starbucks. We had to shut down the Starbucks. Yeah. And, um, they actually said, could you possibly stop coming? We because send... we've come with 83 orders. And we'd like 145 wrap please. <laughs> <laughs> 50 raspberry things. Yeah. We should send Ollie, and they, the, the locals started to complain. But then it became a tradition that we'd all get rounds of coffee. Day. It cost about 300 quid yeah. a round, didn't it? Yeah. Just... I sent my receipt into my accountant. Did you? Yeah, I claimed the tax back. Ebenezer yeah, Scrooge. Yeah, why wouldn't you? It's true. I forgot that. <laughs> Here's Katie on the uh, on the answer machine. I love machine. this. Listen to her. Boy, boy, boy. Boy, boy, boy. We culled this from Kate's real life because that's the way Kate signs off when she's on the phone. <laughs> Great, it's lovely. <laughs> and we thought it was a really nice little thing, yeah. so we borrowed it from her. We stole, Say bye -bye. Say we bye -bye. stole her life. Say bye-bye. Go, bye. Go, Go on. Go on. Bye-bye. Go on. Bye-bye. But who's is the... Um... There's Horton Jupiter. Who, who goes out with Nicola? He actually, there were a couple of zombie romances. Yeah. Is that his I don't know. Oh. It's interesting, but there are a few zombie romances that blossomed on set. Call them zomances. Or zom zomances. Huh. And um, Horton, who plays the tramp, actually ended up, and I uh, hopefully they're still together. If you're listening to this in 2050, I thought they got lots of kids. But uh, <laughs> they got together, he got together with Mary, the garden zombie. Mm hmm. Yeah. Well, they wouldn't have pizza. lots of kids, will they? Because they'd be eating each other. That's true. Yeah. I love the musical change yeah. in this from outside into the Indian music. Mm. Uh -huh. It's a lovely change. Sean, he gets a diet coat. He thinks, uh -huh. fuck it, I'll have a bread coat. Yeah, right? revel. Set that up. There's Tim in the background who comes in with one arm. Hmm. This is on the very first day we shot this. Did you? That's right. Yeah. That's the first day I was here, too. Yeah, look how awake you look. I was shit in my pants. Were you? Yeah, I was very, I was very afraid. <laughs> a nice comment. Yeah. Well, was, yeah. in, the, in the literal sense or in the... Yeah, oh, literally. I, literally. I was very afraid. You were packing? Mm-hmm. <laughs> There's Susie in the back There's behind Susie. Simon. Oh. Oops. There's a fainting lady. That's CJD. The, that's at the bottom of Ali Pally. Is it? Yeah. Mm. If you actually, guys, if you remember yeah. what your first shots were, point them out when they yeah, come up. Yeah, all right. If you can oh, remember, your first shots. fascinating for people. We were all in the jag, weren't we? I think it was all the same. What? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Are you, if you're just going to be yeah, Saki, was, you can go. I wouldn't. Not you, Kate, me, Dylan. Hello. 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 Oh. Hello, mate. Have you worked with Rafe before, Kate? No, but I really like him. I think he's very funny. He's a very funny guy. <coughs> that was an accident, and we kept it in. And I'm just about to laugh there. <laughs> That ginger kid. <sighs> He's very ginger, isn't he? I like the kids actually, they're all really good. Look at all, yeah. they're all smiling, all looking mean. They're good, yeah. That was a shop in East Finchley uh, that was a real shop. and um, was It was, that was my first day. Ah, that's right, you came in and you did the phone call. Yeah, I did, yeah, from the back of the shop. That's right, and it was, the, um, it was like a week into shooting because it was just over a year ago. Was it really? Yeah. <sighs> Kate came in and read the and did a phone call with me, so it sounded a bit more natural. And that, but in the background, those speakers there—that's that's Ian McKellen. <laughs> <laughs> He's amazing. Uh, he can transform himself. We were lucky How to get him. How still he can be. Hello, mate. I just bought a new Dyson vacuum cleaner. Actually, it's a, it's not an upright. It's one on the, it's you just bought one now. Oh. Oh. Tough oh. times. Tough times. <laughs> this is the sound of wine. This is BBC Radio 4. 
<laughs> Everyone watching this DVD now is going to want to go for a piss. It's very large glass. Are you going to show it with you on MTV doing that My Crib program? Will you show them your Dyson vacuum cleaner? Yeah. Under the stairs. And it'll go... Like a kind of a close-up on yeah. it. And then, yeah, shake the camera. Yeah. And then you'll show them your toilet, empty toilet duck <laughs> bottles. <laughs> I love Bill's That's spin there. Oh, yeah. I love his spin. Who's, who's worked with Bill Nye before? Me. You are, mm-hmm. What did you work with him on? Same thing that you did. I thought you'd work with him before... Oh! <laughs> was it at the thing? Yeah. It's interesting to point out that we would, I actually <laughs> offered... I told Kate that we'd written a part for her and Sean the Dead a read-through for Love Actually, uh, oh. at which myself, Dylan, and uh, Pete, sorry, and uh, Kate was at, and me, Pete and Kate didn't get in the final film, but oh Bill did. Oh, my God. <laughs> Do, you really about about that? Eh? Do you feel really bad about that? You didn't get in the final no, film? No, because uh, Rowan Atkinson ended up playing the part that, you know... Mm-hmm. Laura Linney, it's like you, they got the American in for you, didn't they? Mm-hmm. I thought you were bad. Okay, he's my stepdad. And B, it was an emergency. What, like buying your mum some flowers? No, no matter what you might think, okay, I do not find it difficult to keep my work and my social life. I love, sorry, I love Bill in that scene because he doesn't look at you at all. I know, and he does that lovely little smile as well. And look at that shit eating grin on Ray's face there. This is one of my yeah. favourite bits. Hello, Hello Ruth. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say, Ruth? <laughs> Do you remember when I came up to you that thing with the cap on and sort of written your part? Did you just think yes. I was some fucking geek? Some no. creepy guy? Goodbye, Liz. And then we brought you into Big Talk and then you and we and you had a ringtone on your phone that was like twenty eight days later. That's right. Yeah. Ruff, ruff. Um Crouch and. That guy's still running, isn't he? Sorry. Yep. Um, I saw him yesterday. <laughs> A lot of English place names sound like minor bowel diseases, don't they? <laughs> Crouch end. <laughs> More. Uh, the first one. Tring. Whopping. <laughs> yeah. Tring. Tring has got to be some kind Paisley of... Paisley knob. <laughs> Chipping Norton. <laughs> Tumorous anus. <laughs> <laughs> Diarrhea on sea. <laughs> <laughs> That's Patchy the pigeon. Oh. Distended bumton. <laughs> I probably... <laughs> God, it's late. It's getting Prolapse on. for sure. Is this thing on? <laughs> <laughs> Tough crowd. Look at that old hippie coffin. I was tired on this day, I remember as well. And you were oh, the same thing the whole time, didn't you? Wasn't this tired. the last day? <laughs> you it's, are. it's hard acting, isn't it? Really? It is tired, hard acting. Yeah. I, I'm in every scene. I know you're in every scene. Did you get tired? Yeah, I did get tired. Oh. And that shirt got really smelly, didn't it? You, you, yes. Oh, it was held together God. with Febreze. <laughs> I know, you, last I'm really sorry for that. that. Jessica Stevenson, everybody! Jessica Stevenson, of course, the, the shining light that she is, coming along and being Yvonne, which is very I important I like her character. fringe there. I think she looks like it's Captain Janeway. In America, they're called bangs. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> oh. oh, he's thinking of something. Oh, Ten years. shit. Do you, Lucy, do you remember when you came in for your casting? Yes, I do. I was going away the next day for three months. That's and, right. Um, oh, you went to LA again? Yeah. Oh, fucking jetting across the world I, all the time, aren't you? Yeah, I swear. The one audition I've forgotten. Did you get the part weird. in the miniseries set in the zoo? <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm going to say yes, and then I'm going to work out what that is. You're playing, you are playing Betty the Zebra? <laughs> no. I think we're putting all of your uh, audition footage on the on the extras, actually. Oh, no. that's really oh, awesome. kind of you. Thank oh, you very much. God. I was watching you. You were really good. It was all, that's why you got the parts. What's oh. wrong with that? Oh, oh presumably really we nice. weren't shit. Show me with my pants around my knees. Thank you very <laughs> much. <laughs> you chose to do that. Show oh, I, I kept recommending other people for the part. I didn't think I was going to, you know, get the, the gig. I remember because it came, cause, uh, Who did it you was, recommend? Came out, it really came out of the blue. I said David Williams, I think. I thought he'd be quite good. Yeah. No, you, you, you aced it. I remember watching your tape in my bedroom in the morning. Just when I came to work, it was really weird watching you <coughs> in the thing and going, yes, bizarre. it's him. Yes. <laughs> I want bizarre. him. Now, Simon, why weren't you in the auditions? Because I felt uncomfortable mm. oh. because a lot of people that were coming in I knew and I didn't want them yeah, to, yeah, yeah. you know. And it'd be yeah. very, very intimidating. I mean, imagine walking into a room and it'd be to like seeing Kirk Simon Douglas Peg. hugging Jack Nicholson a little bit. on top of yeah. Warren Beatty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind <laughs> of like... It would like be too much for people. The Golden Globes. <laughs> I was, it was, I, was a, I was being a coward, really. To you were behind that two-way mirror. Should yeah, we I was. talk about this? Spider-Man crossing in the background, look. Yeah, oh, that's yeah. The, the, the guy, Spider-Man. Just open the door. Okay, here. This was really early on in filming. This is David and Di's first appearance after the pub. 
This was a lovely mm. few days we spent on this green. Yeah, and it's it was a very good, good shot for showing up Simon's tint. What is that colour? Is there a name for it? I, they tried to dye it blonde, <laughs> but it, it ended up going kind of red, and it makes me look slightly <clears> ginger. Huh. And now there's a, there's a common belief that I have ginger hair, which is, you know, there's nothing wrong with being ginger, but my hair's actually brown, so screw you. <laughs> Sorry. You look like a flamenco dancer, Lucy. And sure, I'm, yeah. Here she is again. Surely Diane would <laughs> flamenco dance for David. Your eyes are very smoky in that, in that shot, Kate. Yeah, they are, they're nice. Oh. Now, on the deleted <laughs> scenes, we put that, your thing in, the whole thing about the Winchester, which we uh, lost, remember that? Let's go to the Winchester blog, blog. Because we had to speed this scene up a little bit. But it's on the deep, because it's very good. It's weird, actually, there's, when we were looking at the deleted scenes yesterday, there's things that got cut out weren't necessarily cut out because they weren't very good, it was just timing. Do we all look thinner in this scene? I do. I do. I love Dylan in the background, no, look at him, just loving it, love that. lapping it up. <laughs> I look like kind of an, a young, evil Jeffrey Palmer. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like a sitcom waiting to happen. Oh, fuck. Oh. I'm in trouble now. That's it. Yeah, John, I think you've had your roots done since then. Who? Kate. Yeah, your hair's a lot blonder now. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it? <laughs> Oh, Lovely wow. touch. Hasn't got the glasses on. Yeah. Look at little Diane. She doesn't know what's going on. Or does she? <laughs> Look, she, she knows does. exactly. Look at her. Look at the pain in her face. Uh, oh, no, that's it's heartbreaking. Painful. Look like you're watching a cat eat your lunch. Dylan. Eat your lung. <laughs> you haven't been to Italia Conti. That's where we pick up looks like that. <laughs> do, you remember we, do you remember we did this scene over... It was like the last thing we did on one mm. night and the first thing we did the next day. Oh, uh, yeah. Because it was the end of the day and we were at that flat in Highgate. Oh, I didn't enjoy it's that a nice filming flat, in that flat. It, it was, was a nice it. flat, but it was it I was got tough. told off for using the loo. I don't quite but know what it was. you did that gigantic <laughs> pop plop. <laughs> <laughs> God. I had to get dino rod <laughs> round to remove it. <coughs> <coughs> Well, I was eating all those gakes. Gakes? 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 <laughs> I was eating a gake. <laughs> <laughs> and the cat <laughs> stood on my foot. <laughs> That's just a gake. <laughs> oh, my chair's up. Heartbroken. He's been dumped. It ra that, oh, was a, that's, that was a bowser. That, that didn't happens, just doesn't happen. It? Did a dog just bit me like It rains 90% of the yeah. times when And then I tried dumped. to shoot myself and it didn't work and I threw <laughs> no. the gun away and it went so, off. What, what, <laughs> my God, you weren't looking like Father Christmas. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly what that scene is. It's totally yeah. places. This is at, at New... Millwall. Millwall. Good luck tomorrow. Or if you're listening in the future. <laughs> <laughs> Who won? <laughs> if you're listening in the past. Get your pint. Oh, look. That was outside. We did two night shoots, didn't we? That's right. New Cross. <laughs> Me and Nick. Yeah. Oh, you were there, weren't you? You yeah. fell asleep in the pub that time, I remember. I did, yeah. Oh. I wasn't um, there for nights. It was a long night. Oh, and I remember night. I remember some of the extras coming up at the very end, like 4 30 in the morning, yeah. going, Simon, I just want to say thank you so much. <laughs> uh, it was fun, though, because it was a running amazing, barbecue. Isn't it? it was like a party. They loved it. We we got egged, the, didn't the we? first day of filming, though, out in the street, we had well, eggs thrown at us. Oh, yeah, so. but then they, yeah. they accepted us then, and it was nice. Frightened me a bit. Sure. Really? Did they? Yeah, yeah. they egged us. Well, they, the locals were quite weird, and then... Where was that here? In Millwall? Millwall. Millwall. Yeah. But I noticed in Millwall that around that estate, even at four or five in the morning, there was still a young lad on a bike. There on, was, on yeah, a BMX. with no yeah. mother around at all. No. Oh. It was a lovely, lovely place. Yeah, well, yeah. yeah. Do you know what? It did, we joke, but it did turn out to be the, a really good time, and the guys, the local yeah. guys, all did our security. Oh, they The night time, well, we thought it was going to be terrifying. Cause but it was the like reason they were so good area. is that they were the kind of people you were trying to keep away, and they were all employed, keeping nobody exactly. away, because they it's were a, them. It's a, smart, <laughs> it's a smart move to do. <laughs> and do you remember on our call sheets, it says, it's... Um, don't wear Please any do football not wear colours. Any other yeah. football colours. It, it, it said on the call, it said, don't come in today. But you have to be there at seven. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> if you want to live, don't come in. Otherwise, come in. <laughs> Nick, what, tell me the genesis of your monkey impression. Oh, fuck off, Simon. <laughs> what do you mean, the genesis? Tough times for you. How it came to be. Yeah, because you did it before. You were a living for ten years just doing that, didn't you? <laughs> that is correct. On the... Uh, on the lucrative ape circuit. <laughs> 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 well, that's Edgar's girlfriend's mum. Patricia, Patricia Franklin. Yes. Patricia? 
Who used to be in uh, Carry On films. Yes, she was in it. I think Edgar actually yesterday listed all the Carry On films that she's been in. I can't believe in. you do that, Nick. And What's that? that, that you should see the other things that he does. Do the DP thing. Oh, that's like sex, isn't it? One. Oh, there's the bump. Oh, in it goes. <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> Dogs Can't Look Up comes from a, 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 a supposition that Nick foolishly put forward that dogs that he thought that dogs can't listen up. just because it's in a film doesn't mean you haven't proved it but the only where, reason you said it was because where do you get that from of course they do they howl wasn't they do you that with their... yeah but they're moving their whole the... <laughs> no they're not it's from the neck up it's like because we, we shot a scene in space when Ada Colin had to look back at the house no. and but the person that was trying to make her look back was on the ground floor and really who she was supposed to be looking back at was Daisy who was in the window but mm. she didn't look up and Nick just thought it was because dogs can't look up. But to be fair, dogs don't have a lot of call to look up, no. do they? I mean, what's up there for them? <laughs> Unless they want to fuck a great dame. <laughs> <laughs> and let's face it, who doesn't? Unless it's like a frisbee hound. Uh, you know, they look up to catch. Oh, there are true. some stories we should have rehearsed before we began <laughs> and we would need not have I done think them. perhaps all stories. <laughs> it's hot in here. No, we did this about 15 times. I like, I like my little claws on you constantly. There's lots of bits of snogging. A, well, that's, that's actually an actor that she's snogging. He's the only actor in the country that can do this. Oh. oh. <laughs> what I, what what I did loved do? about... Huh? What did he do? Who? The actor. He's a dummy. Who was it? His head fell off. Oh, she had a snog a dummy. <laughs> Have you seen this film, Kate? <laughs> yes, I have. Oh, I thought you meant someone could actually sort of dislocate their neck or something. Yeah, I know, I was joking. Oh, I see. <laughs> what were you going to say, Nick? Before Kate interrupted with that weird <laughs> comment. I think I was going to say exactly what Kate said. <laughs> are you? <laughs> I love that. Do it, Kate. That's brilliant. I didn't do it. I don't know who's that. No. Was that? no. Oh, I like this scene. <clears throat> This is on the last, like the last day, but one, I think. For a big man, I can well yeah. move. <laughs> <laughs> but look at you, it looks like we're oh. engaging. What no. is it with the caps? Um, I yeah. don't know, I think we decided, we, went, we asked Annie, the costume uh, designer, to get us a couple of caps and... I quite like bench jeans, by the way, on girls. Do you? Are you trying to get a free pair? No, God. There's a funny thing on the. I think we've got. I think it's on the DVD actually. If we had to do an airline version of this and everything, Pete says oh, really? it's funk rather than fuck. Yeah. Oh, are you joking? And so then when Nick says prick, funk, he says funk off. he calls him prink. Prink. <laughs> what does this do with? <laughs> what does that become? Couch? What? <laughs> Couch rot. <laughs> Kin. What, what do they say? What do they do? Cash. Cash off. Can you can? <laughs> Frip off and cash off. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, why didn't we? we I don't know. And why do they do it on planes, though? Do they think people no. are suddenly going to, you know, become some, moralistic? Yes, right from Surbiton to I was disgusted. By, especially thirty thousand feet up, it's far more disgusting. <laughs> Wouldn't ordinarily be offended. No, because of the altitude. Yeah, yeah, yeah but it's like alcohol affects double in the air, so you know it's just as much worse. What did she say? That's true. I don't know. It's like alcohol when you're in the air, the effect doubles. Oh, exactly. Yes, yeah. the air rate. Huh? You heard. Hey, Pete's very. Pete's actually a very laid-back sort of, you know, very gentle man. It's quite interesting to see him being so. Uh, mm. Again. This is like the last day, but one, wasn't it? Everyone was had it? gone. Yeah. That was my last scene ever. Was it? Oh. Yeah. I remember this. See, if I was watching this and listening to us, I'd be really fucked off by now. Why? Oh. Shh, I'm trying yeah, to but you don't, but have, you don't to. have to. You, watch you can it. switch it over. I know. <laughs> I, wouldn't, oh. I don't listen to comments a bit. No, I know. There's you do. again, there's Kate on the thing. I don't. I like to listen to them when I'm popping off to sleep. You yeah, know, but just... they always they say things like, oh, we used the steady cam in that one because Roger had a bad knee or whatever. And who gives a fuck? That's, we actually had this on a dolly because uh, David had a sore back and. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That was a. I had to step on over the tracks to get into the kitchen. This is a lovely transition. Watch that. Bang. Oh, that's pretty. Day. Yeah, I just sat there all night, didn't you? Yeah, all night. Yeah. Twelve hours, I was there. We had a sore neck yeah. at the end of it. Waiting for the sun to come up, and it did in that part of London, didn't it? It was just like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just like that click. I love this bit. Isn't it? Brilliant young actor, Nick Frost. I like the way you look. <laughs> You're Cornetto. Cornetto. That really, that really Very like the early John Crawford. Asleep. I love it. <laughs> They had, is it true they had to put that little bauble on the uh, gate so you wouldn't see Pete's Willie when he comes out? Correct. 
No. Now this is my first scene I shot on the very first day. No, on, on really? the very first scene was this. This is we did. The, we did it ass backwards. Did the. You look uh, a bit nervous. We did the zombie morning. <laughs> the steady cam shot. Are you putting eight hour cream on? Mm, yeah. Elizabeth Arden. Yeah. Oh, yeah nice. Dehydrated. Yeah, it's good. Been traveling. Just the eight hours. What happens after? <laughs> I'll put some more uh, in there. You the hands dissolve. <laughs> Do you set the alarm? <laughs> yeah. that was Chris Dickens, our editor, running by. That was. And everybody you can see now as a zombie in the background was glimpsed and you in just the first don't notice. bit. I think people realise that. But they were. Do you think? <laughs> Come on, Kate. Are you? Oh, you just. What? Oh, you're so oh, negative. Kate's oh, wait a minute. Is it brown? brown? He takes lips. a real coke and lips, then thinks, lips. "Fuck it, diet." My favourite bit coming up: He's the little changed. squeak. He's oh yeah. Oh, you get that. You're good at that. Mm. Which bit? <laughs> do that bit too much. The slipping on the. Um, what's your favourite ice cream, Kate? <laughs> 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 just like to say that Dylan's just put eight hour cream on I just feel, I feel like I've... <laughs> I used to put that on myself too. a little fairy gypsy. <laughs> 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 I can't get that that line out of my head from your show the other night about sucking off a smurf. It was such a beautiful word. Salty blue bulb. <laughs> lolling well, on your tongue. It's in every man to desire. <laughs> <laughs> it, was a, it was poetry. I love that guy with his head's blustered open. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Kate? Cat got your tongue. <laughs> Here's Horton again. Who? Uh, if Minus you... dog, by the way. Is that his first name, Horton? Horton Jupiter. Really? And in the 2000 AD oh. story that we did for Shaun of the Dead for 2000 AD, it's all about how he bites Mary and turns Mary into Mary and how she bites Mark and bites Mark's lips off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name? Krishnan Guru Murthy. Is it? Well done. That's Morrissey. Oh. That's Morrissey Guru Murthy. That's Nick's voice saying serious attacks. <laughs> oh, there lovely. he is. He's lovely, that bloke. JT. Yeah. We shared a wee together after the premiere. I told that his name. You drank wee together? No, we had a wee side by side. You had, sorry, you had some wee side by side? <laughs> <laughs> we, yeah. In the toilet, we looked at each other's wheat. <laughs> <laughs> each other's <laughs> wheat ones. Who had the most wheat? He had a long sheath. <laughs> I can't sheath. believe Sheath. Sheath. <laughs> oh. OK, so this is the beginning of the morning, and this is my favourite shot and my favourite sequence in the film as well. Is it? Mary in the oh. car. That was is one of the very first things. Bit? Yeah. Well, this is one of the very first things we oh, came oh. up with, was having the idea of a... So muscular. She's doing a great junkie lean. A girl in the garden. She's brilliant. I love Nicola. I've got such a soft spot for her. Mm -hmm. she, so she, she, when she did her casting, she looked, she looked really upset. I love oh. the fact that she doesn't like being a zombie. She was upset in the casting? She just made all the other... Everyone was really good in the Mary yeah. castings, but she just had it because she, she had a, this expression on her face that just said, oh, I don't want to be a zombie. Oh. And it, it made her really tragic. Look at her. She's so sweet. Oh. Like a little gerbil. Oh. oh. I just want to cuddle her up and kill her. <laughs> 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 that does make me laugh that you think she's drunk. That's the only line we'd changed in actually with with the view to the American audience is that if we'd said she was pissed, they would have thought we meant she was angry. Angry, yeah. And that would have completely defeated the joke. But you said drunk. Yeah, drunk that's what we changed. Better, I think. Oh I drunk. see. Yeah. It's probably their loss. But drunk is funny. <laughs> it's a funny word. Yeah, yeah, yeah it is funny, isn't it? Because it's a bit uh, one of those her one face, syllables. Oh, well, you know, okay. Sorry? <laughs> <laughs> I like her voice is kind of weirdly no, noisied, uh, Mary. Mary I'm, I'm warning you, okay? I'm it's kind of euphonic, it. isn't it? Excuse me? This is it. Oh. Oh, and I, this uh, is... Oh, oh, oh. Bang! Oh, that's horrid. I just Lord. watch... <laughs> just watch, watch her guts get sucked back in as oh, she yeah, gets... Yeah. See, they're sticking out there, and they go... Oh, yeah, do it, do it. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> How did you do that? Yeah. Well, if you want to know, it. on the DVD there's actually a composite oh. sequence when they show all the really? bits. They filmed Nicola falling, they filmed the post, they filmed the hole, they filmed us, they filmed the blood splat, and they filmed the guts, and they put them all together to make that. OK. Bang! Oh. Big Mark there Donovan. Is. Big... <laughs> Lovely fella. Great zombie. Oh. Sorry. Huh. Sean, what's going on? Shit. I was really tired on this day. I think I'm going to... Are you tired? <laughs> I think I'm going to cough. <laughs> Do it. <clears throat> it's one number, 
Ed and it's busy. You got you do some good coughs actually. I'm yeah, I've got a range. You've got a great range of coughs. I hate my hair though. Get a real rattle in there. Yeah. Church organ. Why? It's too thick. Nick, can you explain why you had a hole in your hair? Yeah. Uh, just thought the thought Ed would. Uh, I thought Ed would would. Edward Wood would. Wood, wood. I thought he would look <laughs> good <laughs> with, a, wood, with a lump of hair no missing. In his Do you want to talk about any other follicle-related issues? <laughs> no. Well, I thought it's like uh, what's his name, Ving Rams, uh, plaster at the back of his neck. Ving Rams, that's that side string, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> it is. <laughs> it's just you know. It was just an affectation, right? Yeah. And you shaved your pubes off, right? I shaved all my pubes mm, off, yeah. Yeah, you did. And that is something that I continue to this day. I remember you were always having a good scratch. I know. Here comes Tim Bagley. What do you mean you continue to this day? I shave, shave constantly. Simon, what do you mean, Tim yeah, Bagley? Why? That's the actor who played the groom. Oh, there's an actor I've just worked with in America called Tim Bagley. Oh, really? Yeah, I, I don't know. That guy's only got one arm. Oh. He's, Bang. A, he's remarkable. I was saying, I'd said on the actual other commentary, they'd go about the way yeah. Tim was very, you know, he was the person to, who would make jokes the most about his own arm being off and uh, make everyone feel comfortable with it. But it was, I was just was so impressed by all the amputees that we worked with because they were made up to look like the day when their arm got knocked off. Mm, and, that's right. You know, you just got to uh, marvel at that because it must have been quite an awful day. Hmm. <laughs> this is BBC Radio. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is Arms Off AM. <laughs> FM. <laughs> what? Wait, say Look at Kate. You're supposed to say it. Say it. No. She just swallowed her ricola. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy Thompson. When we were, I actually directed some of Jeremy. I, I just want to point out. Uh, when I went into Sky and said to Jeremy... Um, just, you know, remember when you've reported some terrible things and, and give it the same kind of gravitas. And he was so good. He was like a proper actor. He was, actor. yeah. He really did. Oh, look. I love doing this because I like, I like throwing junk at girls. Yeah. No, you don't because we never threw anything at Nicola. Edgar offered, offered us a fiver who could hit Mark in the head with that toaster and we never got it. Edgar, yeah, we did. I didn't. Look. Yeah, yes. but no, we, he never gave us the money. What oh, he never got the money. What, what, yeah. was, what was the toaster made of? Rubber. Rubber. What was Mark made of? Rubber. <laughs> rubber. Flubber. Even though they were rubber, I still pity them having them thrown at their heads. Well, Edgar had yeah. to pick the takes really carefully because we... Oh, no. See, oh. We just used to chuck at Mark because we didn't want to hurt Mar to hurt Nicola. God, it's bad getting a record in the eye. I w now, Ian Brown of the Stone Roses is currently working in the adjacent studio and I wanted to bring him in and see if he'd like the joke about not chucking uh, the second coming. Probably wouldn't have a sense of the old one. I was going to tell him that I went to Spike Island. I was going to tell him I saw him at the beer keller in 99. I don't think he'd hear you. He'd be out of his face and drugs, wouldn't he? No, 89. <laughs> oh, don't make assumptions about pop stars. Well, I'm sorry. But... <laughs> He's probably got a gob full of oysters. <laughs> you can't get that wall-eyed stare from too many cornflakes, can you? <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember when we were writing the script in rehearsals and we said about... We were going to chuck Jagged Little Pill and you wouldn't. You said no, Liz wouldn't would own Jagged Little Pill. That's true. <laughs> That's the most you said this afternoon. Uh, I like our little move. Kate's going to say something. <clears throat> <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, dummies. Eat it. Uh, Eat I think it. that's one of my favourite bits. Yeah, this is fun, this bit. Yeah. Because it looks was, like very hard work. It was really tiring. I had to have injections. Because this little oh, you did, twat you? on the right yeah. broke my arm. <laughs> I didn't break your arm. You, just because you can't take a punch, yeah. you big lemon jelly. Oh, how many cornettos <laughs> did you get to eat? Um, I got through a lot. Oh, how lovely. Before we started filming, I was eight stone eight. <laughs> <laughs> and now I'm 18 stone ten. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Peter. Oh. I got wood. We both early on decided that we'd, we'd Nick, uh, Sean and Ed would wear the same clothes all day for the whole thing. We all would, but particularly um, Sean obviously doesn't mm. change at all in the film, apart from the beginning and end. So liberating for me just to, just to wear that for ten weeks. I know. Why? With your baldy balls it's just knocking nice around. to wear a shorts. Yeah, I liked wearing them. And then, then when we had to do a couple of scenes in different outfits, it was really annoyed. Oh. Because no, you get so them. comfortable in what you yeah. want. Imagine what it's like for Nick zipping himself into his German street suits every day, just the relief of getting to wear t-shirts and shorts. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> and you had, but your the length, the cord on your shorts had to be the same length. Yeah, remember, I tied it all off. Are you, you still doing the next year's Prada campaign? Oh yes. Because <laughs> mum. Quite fancy Penelope. 
Oh, well, that's not so fancy. Well, are they still there? Did you try the police? Yeah, but I do. The only thing about Penelope was when she came in, she was on, and then you realised very quickly that she's very, very good, and that became kind of annoying. She was. A, if, you, if, you, if, you, if you watch the film and just watch Penelope, she just is always, always working. She's amazing. Mm. She's fantastic. She was. She was. Remember that thing she said to you that time? Once? Why do you tell that story? No, it's not. <laughs> But she's quite Penelope. You know, we were often quite. Although Nick was had a quite funny relationship with her, in that he'd just say really disgusting things, and she'd really laugh. But she's, she's still a woman, so, you know. I know. But we obviously there's sort of <laughs> she's Penelope, and you at first we were a bit kind of like even you know, parents of people. Not true. Now on that scene there, you can't see it, but if you wind it back, there's a lawnmower with an arm hanging off it, which I thought was a really nice oh. touch. Will we see it next time round? Did that not hurt Bill when you whacked him on the head? It was, that was Bill. not Bill. Wasn't it? It was a stuntman with a Bill helmet on. Uh, <laughs> or Bill Belmit. Belmit. A Belmit. <laughs> <laughs> you can get Belmits from Halfords. <laughs> Ooh. I hate. I don't like that. The way I say that. Why? I think I really fucked the film up. <laughs> Why? It's a really funny line. Could have done People better. are really quoting it now. All on the streets. I don't like the way that you s you sniff the spade covered in brains. Oh no, it's not that shot. It's actually when we do oh, go there. So it's not it, the arm's not on that then. No, it's you'll see it coming up. I, I thought we did have good fun doing that, didn't we? That was fun, wasn't yeah. it? Although I to, you're very, very light, I have to say, but we did have to do it like ten times. Yeah, we did. It was starting to hurt my wrist. But you're very light. I'm not wrist. saying you're heavy. <laughs> my wrist. It's <laughs> gossamer like. She is like an air, like an air lady. Mm. Oh, what did you think of your costume? I liked it. You had those paper denim cloth jeans and you know, from America. They were quite did. nice. Yeah, that, that Jim Wilson went and bought, didn't he? That's right, yeah. We all basically chose our costumes, right? Yeah. <laughs> Lucy, you chose your costume, yeah. didn't you? You tried a load of different things on. I tried literally about 83 different outfits it's on. It's a specific three. number. It's specific because I counted it. <laughs> but you... Uh, the, the Poor Annie Harding. <laughs> She's great, though, right? She was really good, but she had to put up with me going... Ling, 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 ling. Dylan. I like it. Um, I can see it, I can see it, it's just outside. Sorry. This was my, uh, no. When we exit the door here, that was my first ever shot. Dylan, did you choose your costume? Yes, I did. I said you should wear a rugby shirt and whatever. Oh, that's right, you did. That was your idea, I remember, because we thought it was very good that he but would I wear a rugby shirt. Microphone. That's OK. Dylan was just wandering around the studio doing a small dance. Yeah, huh? sorry. I had to get up and stretch my ligaments. <laughs> now... Yeah, 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 yeah. This is when you look you look tired in this scene, actually, Nick. Really? I was really tired. You retired, Nick. <laughs> yeah, I was. Was it getting to you? Yeah, or was he acting? Did he get knackered. on top of you? Learning lines and pretending is really tiring. Yeah. Oh. Dylan, Dylan, look. There's a, there's a message for you. Uh, <laughs> here's me throwing my badge. Actually took about 30 takes to get it that good. Did it? Um, Why? Because I, you, you had to get try. it to land properly. I'm trying to sweep now. <sighs> They're nice. I'm ready for bed. Are you? <laughs> Tired now. Mm. Pete, Seraphim, who, who oh. went through hours of makeup to look like a, um, a zombie oh. and had to be, and was wearing nothing but a posing pouch or a oh. modesty pouch. It's more like a child's yeah. sleeping bag. Yeah. <laughs> it, was, it was voluminous. <laughs> uh, it looks like a Hulk. I could do with less bare feet being seen in films, really? couldn't you? Yeah. You're not a fan of feet? No. Really? No, yeah. I could do with less bare feet, less brushing of teeth, less picking of bottoms. That's where you look tired. There was actually a take of that we didn't use of That's Nick my first really shot. pulling his trousers out of his ass. Is it? Yeah. Is that your first, first shot? First thing I did. So have we missed your go you guys' first shot? Was your was that the one in the pub when you were? Yeah. Was that your first? Yeah, you didn't shot? care. Yeah. But it didn't mean much to you. It means everything it to me. Mean I thought you meant you. I Don't thought you meant the first shot that we actually filmed. Yeah. Which was the jag. The it will be an exterior jaguar. shot. Oh yeah, it was. It was yeah. It was yeah, her, yeah. So they haven't yeah, come up to it yeah. yet. Yeah. What? You heard. Hmm. Your first shot was outside. First Try. shot that we actually did. Here's Uplands Road in Crouch End, which is the longest terrace in London. Is it really? Yep. Wow. I hear the parking's very, very good there. The parking's brilliant. It's non-CPZ, and let's keep Crouch End that way, yeah? That's, uh, who's that actor in there, Nick? Mm. 
in the body bag. It was no idea. Uh, Caroline, that was Car- wasn't that Christopher Walken? <laughs> yeah, called <laughs> Caroline Quentin. Now, originally, this was a very hard house, wasn't it? Yeah, you, you, you. It was your idea that Ed should be just a banging pill popping yeah. house up fan. And now it's just what it's just soft, rock, no, soft it's ash, bungalow. <laughs> <laughs> now there's some zombies coming up to the fence behind who I think were friends of ours. This Ed, guy was Ed an amputee, wasn't he? Time out was that? Yeah, that's Chris who was an amputee. He was very good. Not was many he? people was can he do an amputee? that. Is that what? Yeah, he only had one leg. Did he? Mm. Which one do you think it was? Ed, that's not the point. Oh, oh. Dear, stop dear. ragging on Kate. Uh, he yeah. was great, Chris. He was fun, and he was a good sport. And he spent a long time covered in blood and uh, lying on the ground. Lying on the ground. He looked great. But he was right on the front there of the, there's there's the, the, arm. There's the arm on the thing. Uh, I missed it. He was on the front of the oh, that Hornsey Journal. That was all the I, Hornsey Journal. Yeah, they did a little thing that went lights, camera, blood, and there was a picture <laughs> of Chris on the front of the thing. Oh. We like the idea that Philip had been cleaning his car and he'd been bitten. Okay. By a zombie, which is why there's still a sponge in a bucket outside. If it wasn't the bucket and sponge wasn't for him, he wasn't cleaning himself beside his car. <laughs> <laughs> he might have been, just sponging himself down. Hang on, I didn't think he got bitten until he came out of the house with you and then... No, because he's been bitten once on his arm. Oh, gosh, that will pass me by. Because B- Barbara says it on the phone. Don't give us a scene, Sean of the Dead. <laughs> yeah, because <laughs> that's what, they're waiting for the doctor. Know, they're just a bit poor. That, thank you, Kate. Yeah. Yes. Yes, <laughs> Here she is, that's Penelope's first scene. Have a decrease in Wilton's. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, the, I think the, cha- the, the DVD chapter when she dies is called Ever Decreasing Barbara. Oh. <laughs> really? Yeah. And the tableau, The Death of John the Baptist. <laughs> <laughs> Look. OK. Oh. We were very lucky to get uh, Bill and Penelope because they gave the film a, a real sort of gravitas because mm. they're proper actors, as, unlike us upstarts. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Bob and Kate, who killed Hitler, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God. Someone had to. And there's, uh, on the television oh, there, is um, Naira Park, our producer, her fella, her, her fella's dad is the priest on the telly. Oh, that's right, yeah. And Naira's dad is the... Doctor, you see on the TV talking about the crisis every now and again. Yes, he's actually a surgeon, isn't he? He is, Doctor Park. He's a uh, brain oh. surgeon. Would he be Doctor or would he be Mister? Or <laughs> he's Doctor. Right. Okay. If you're a Mister, if you're a brain surgeon, I don't know. It's not brain surgeon. No, <laughs> it's not rocket Mr. science. Mister Brain Surgeon. I think uh, you know. It's like once you get above a certain, once you're a consultant, you're then Mister. You go back to being a Mister. Yeah. Mm. That's hardly worth the effort, is it? You go all the way away. You spend some time as a doctor and end up as a Mister. And if well, you're I beyond think... that, you're that bloke. <laughs> that bloke who makes. Makes me in brain work. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't tell the doctor, did you? Which <laughs> <laughs> everybody trying to try and do Bill now. <laughs> okay, ready. Okay. Yeah, you go round the table. Right. You go first. You didn't call the doctor, did you? <laughs> <laughs> okay, quick, do it. The only thing I can do is when he when he was um he did dying and then he'd go. <laughs> <laughs> Nick, Nick. Sean, you just got to be a man. <laughs> <laughs> Lucy. Um, let's all get into our jammers and have normal clothes. Dylan. You didn't call the dog, did you? <laughs> <laughs> we had our jabs when we went to the Isle of Wight. It's fantastic the way the words come out of Bill. It's like they're, it's like they're being pumped by this very, very tiny bellows. <laughs> <laughs> That's the secret to his success, tiny bellows. We had problems with this because I, I used to laugh at Penelope. Huh. Penelope was a, quite a mischief maker, actually. She, she used to, for, for all her no, consummate not. professionalism, she used to make me laugh by making this funny face where she made her lip quiver. <laughs> and it used to really make me laugh. And it was the look of hatred. <laughs> She'd growl at me. Here he comes. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. We can't hear him. What's he saying? Got a real man. <laughs> It'd be a great cowboy, wouldn't he? David He'd Dunlap, who's our, who's our DP, was very impressed at the fact that I managed to spin the knife so that it went shing mm. off the camera. That's because I could see How it in the lens. Shing! He's talking about his cock. Nick. Yeah, I got an Nick. erection. <laughs> <laughs> Dylan looks at you with real disgust, then. <laughs> <laughs> As if to say, oh, Nick. Oh, Nicholas. I could have pranked it better. You could have pranked it better. You you did that, didn't you? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. It's a whole deleted scene. 
Oh shit! Here comes Kia. Oh hello. That's Kia and Matt who are, play, who are playing oh. the clubber zombies, and Edgar's friend Ollie in the background who was in Fistful of Fingers. Edgar's first film. Bang, this guy was bang. great. Oh. He was a great mover. He was. Look at this. Whack. Jaw. And then it's going to be a jab to the face. Sock. I lost so much skin on the front of that juggy when I did, when I did that skid across the front of it. Where did you lose the skin from? From my wrist. It just My wrist just dragged along and I, lo I left. Was it your trouser wrist or your wrist? <laughs> my trouser wrist. <laughs> Seems like your wrist was quite strained throughout the whole thing. What are you saying? Did you lose a lot of wrist work afterwards? <laughs> there was a lot of wrist work that evening. <sighs> we all got hurt in a way, didn't we? Did you get any injuries? I remember shutting my hand in the door. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's yeah. right. Yeah. Oh, God, we were all panicking. That was like... It went all flat at the end, like a comedy hand. <laughs> like a I had a latte that was a bit too hot one day. <laughs> <laughs> Lucy threw an orange at me. Or did I throw no. it at you? You got a shell what? in the face. Oh yeah, you got a burnt oh, face yes, and a burnt I'm hand. Best at getting hurt. All right, seriously, let's list injuries. I got uh, quite a few. Uh, yeah. My elbows are scabbed. I got a scabbed wrist. You got a uh, flat fingers. Yeah. You got a busted back and shoulder. Shoulder. I got shot. You got a burnt Literally face from a shot. shell, Dylan. And my entire lower half is burnt. <laughs> off. <laughs> burnt off. You nearly got. <laughs> you nearly got cut in half, half, half the window, window exploded. Window. Well, no, I didn't. That was all right. Was Why did you? Why did I make a big scene about it? Why were you so angry? Because I need to have a scene on every film I do. <laughs> <laughs> Just so people remember I'm around. Yeah. I thought you were entirely justified. I think it was very dangerous. We haven't been in it much thus far. I think we ought to crack on. OK, you're coming on now. There you are, that's you. The, uh, the orange thing, by the way, was you were stuffing an orange in my mouth while strangling me while I was going, it was the Dukes. <laughs> Don't split hairs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now here you guys are. Yeah. Your thoughts on this day? I didn't like the flat. <laughs> they were long days. Oh, she's taking a photo of me. That's a she. You can hear. <laughs> you can hear Nick's camera going off. Not mine. Yeah. I'll take some time. Now that was. Um, I was actually on a little kind of... The, the beeping you can hear are cyber shots going off. I was actually on a platform outside the window and I climbed up. Yeah, yeah. you didn't really climb up, I didn't up, really did climb you? all the way up, did I? Cyber shots. I couldn't get this... I kept saying this wrong. It was... This day was a long day and we all had set marks and we weren't allowed to move. I know. Breathe off That's them. right, yeah. We are all a half an inch from each other. Yeah. Incur the wrath of China, our focus puller, who it would beat us up if he didn't hit our marks. Yeah. <laughs> China mum. Oh, you weren't here, were you? I had the day off that day. I came in, though. Look at your furrowed brow, Kate. You were really confused as to what to do with the zombies. Yeah. <laughs> yes, you weren't Dylan. sure. Mm, Dylan, hey, what? Shall I drop? Yeah. That's my favourite line of yours, Dylan. Right, it's what? I'm not going out there. Ain't it? It's the... It's the... Sorry? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> pour, pour, pour the wine. You're wearing lenses, Kate. No. Oh, flash, what do you have in mind? Oh, flash. Okay. Hey, blue. There we go. The girls do are quite this glamorous funny, in this I film, think. aren't they? This bit when you say, I don't think you should own a car. That was one of the first lines we wrote. That one. That's great. Really? There's no point owning a car in London. Did you build the entire film around, around that, that one line? line. Yeah. <laughs> that hurt when I did that. Ow. Ow. Oh, Willow. <laughs> it's Kill Bill. There's a couple of old zombies. You see them at the beginning. Look at their faces. <laughs> Bang. Now, how many times did we do this? Quite a 15. few. Fifteen. Uh, I don't really hit anyone there. Look. That's I don't because my driftwood is oh, driftwood. It's not rubber. <laughs> I like the way I just go back to just kill the one off there. Oh, <coughs> here he comes. <laughs> Uh, that so got we... a massive laugh in New York. Really Did huge it? laugh. I suddenly started thinking, oh no, are they going to get that kind You're of speaking thing? in an yeah. octave that doesn't exist. I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's, the, it's the forbidden note. <laughs> <laughs> Put la boite diabolique. <laughs> <laughs> I was worried that that, that joke, because obviously it's about Ed's being inappropriate, but um, it, it does seem to work. I'm, I'm glad people got it. I was all slightly less keen on it than Edgar was, because I felt that maybe it wasn't funny. 
Just because if you have been called that, it's not such a nice word. But Edgar finds it funny in the same way he finds the word poo and wee funny. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he really gives you a funny look then, doesn't he? Now, we spent how long? Oh, Eight God. days in this car? Yeah. Like this. Oh, was 18, wasn't yeah. it? There was a time when we were in it five hours in a row, mm. and I'm sat on dinner time, and when we got out... We Neither of us could walk. We couldn't straighten our legs no. for about a minute and a That's half. Right. And we were on the back of a low loader, which is a sort of truck that pulls the car along, yeah. and we were also... Would we ever actually in it when somebody was driving it? Yeah, yeah, I was driving it going. doing this. Yeah, Nick did swervy driving. That's right. You are very good, actually, I remember. You were. Thanks, didn't you? Yeah. Oh, that's right, yeah. Bill must have been so uncomfortable. Bill had blood in his knickers yeah. at this point. He did, it was sticky everywhere, wasn't mm. it? But he was, we had such a laugh in that. I mean, we, we, we yeah, kept spirits up by just sort of, you know, keeping happy <clears> and stuff. Yeah. Having some fun. Look at his hand all covered in blood and his neck spewing plasma. <laughs> <laughs> that's when you were doing spewing. that about Al Pacino, wasn't it? I cry. I cry. <laughs> you don't cry in this scene. I cry. <laughs> <laughs> What was that from? Yeah. I can't remember. It was about stealing the limelight with tears. When I come in, you cry, and then I cry because you're crying. <laughs> hey, hey, uh, how about this? Uh, this thing? <laughs> how about if I cry? <laughs> That's it. Here's an idea. Here's an idea. In the next scene, you don't cry. I cry. <laughs> I'm in the dark here. <laughs> the, woman, the woman that has just lost her son. It's good, but what if I cry? <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't cry. Cause I cry. <laughs> <laughs> There's a severed head in the road there, in a, in a helmet. Whoa, mama. That was very near the beginning as well, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. This is All where this bits. is where I hurt Nick's so shoulder. This shoulder. is where you got your Dude. finger caught in the door. Yep. I shut it myself. I still had yet to be shot. Okay, you're taking your headphones off. Are you okay? Yes, they're hurting my ears a little bit. Oh, that's all right. <laughs> Look at oh god. Oh shit. Ooh. <laughs> Here comes Billy. We rehearsed this. We had a jag in stage one at Ealing Studios. Not this one, but we and we we rehearsed it. Were you there, Dylan? No, I don't know. When we rehearsed it, we, it just in the jag in the studio. I don't think you were there. I think you had to go away. Yeah. It's the eighties Matchbox Beeline disaster in the background. Great young band of gothic tearaways. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, you're you. doing your I bit, really aren't you? you. <laughs> <laughs> Zombies ain't all bad. This is where. This is just after Kate got her fingers bashed up. I love this spin. This was on a Sunday morning. Do you remember when we were on that kind of revolving thing and we were mm -hmm. all in the back? Yeah, uh, yeah. I like that. Is it's everybody going to hate me if I smoke another cigarette? No, no, just do it. I might have one with you. Okay. Don't, Nick. You've oh, given right, up. Fine. Right. Also, if Chris is listening to this, yeah, I'll what's tell she going to do? <laughs> she She'll may beat you do. up. I'm not bothered. Here we are. We <laughs> ADR'd this whole scene, didn't we, Kate? Yeah, we this did. We did a we were million good. trillion times. We were, we were times. real good. Because there was some noise, so we had to... Did you ADR this as well? We must have all done it. Yeah, I, I, I don't have to do it. So that yeah. means automatic dialogue replacement, I think. That's that not that noise. <laughs> Ultimate dialogue recording, yeah. Yeah, why don't you tell us what lens we're using here? It's a, four, it's, a, it's a 450. Mm -hmm. Is it a 450 Parmalat? Yeah, and I think they've got, a, like, a 10K up on a gurney. You flip that open. Probably flip open there. I'd have a 15k. I noticed though you don't mention that you were blue screened into every scene because you were at home. Shut up, smoking. Rubbing your thighs. Because I was so tired. Because <laughs> you were so tired from acting. <laughs> I why is acting so tiring? tiring? Why is acting? No, why is it so tiring? It's just the hours, isn't it? <sighs> it is emotionally draining, though. Come I on. I wish I could work in a sewer all day long. <laughs> <laughs> a French sewer, pa Paris sewer would be alright. Yeah. You but might find. Time. Le yeah. chocolat or something. When you're having to emote all the time, it does knack you. Oh, out. don't what? talk to me about emoting, please. <laughs> I, when we did the scene when Barbara dies, I find that very tiring, and I had to go out and have a little cry. And, and so did you, Nick. <laughs> I did. And so did you, Kate. You have to mention the. Yes. We have to mention this scene. Panoply of. Oh, here we are. Jessica Martin Freeman, uh, Reese Shearsmith, Tamsin Gregg, Julia Deacon, and Matt Lucas uh, making up the alternative gang. Hmm. The slightly better off gang. It's the slightly better, slightly more talented gang. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'd like to see their film. I'd like <laughs> yeah, to see how their, good, their battle took place. Yeah. Yeah. Be rubbish. <laughs> you could write it. No. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you, Matt. My wig's better than Matt's. <laughs> <laughs> Matt always looks singularly strange in a wig. He's, he's, his being suits him perfectly. That's a wig? 
Well, whenever they put eyebrows in a wig on Matt, he just looks strange. He, he just, just closes his better. eyes and wills his chest hair up to his head. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there it is. That was good. We had qu- oh, it rained quite a lot this day. I remember that was the day mm. Matt and Dave, or they'd just come up with Andy and Lou from Little Britain, and he was just doing it all. Th- I know, yeah. yeah. I know. Oh, he was doing it all day long. Really? Which was very funny. But uh, they did literally just come up with it, and it was fresh in his head. Yeah. He entertained us all. Yeah, no. His Nick Ewers, who plays the uh, Ewers, who plays the, uh, the pajama, pajama zombie. zombie. Very he good. He is good. He, he is very patient. Or as Nick used to call him, the MP for Zombie North. <laughs> <laughs> he does look like an MP. He does look like an MP. Or I used to think he looked like the pit, one of the Pink Floyd Hammers. <laughs> for some, for some reason. Is that a football team? <laughs> Six of us. Oh, this was a good. This now, this I remember was uh. when. Oh, maybe I shouldn't say that because it's personal. What? When you, <laughs> no, when well, your knickers come no, out of your nose. When we were what? in the garden, I remember it was Kate announced her forth- forthcoming nuptials. Oh, that's true. Yeah. yeah. Oh. That's what I, I remember. Saying. We were all hanging around in the garden. I was playing Space Invaders. That's right. That Space table. Space Invaders. Yeah. That was the game. And then I, but I had a, I had a huge. I, I was going. I can't. But I was really like teased you a lot. And then I came to your trailer later and I said, "Sorry, I didn't mean. I was only joking." Do you yeah, remember? That's true. Yes, I do. Because I thought. Because I had to go and do a take, and I suddenly thought, "Oh shit!" I was really mean to Kate. Yeah, you were. But I was only, <laughs> I was only mucking around. <laughs> oh, were you? Yeah, I was just playing. You know, it's Josh Banter. You better she comes. That in, Kate. <laughs> Swing ball wizard. <laughs> Oh, it's there was a whole scene that we rehearsed when uh, we had it round his neck and stuff, and then oh, yeah. cut it out. Bang! We did a lot of rehearsals in Studio One at Ealing, where Lucy just slept on yeah. the table because she had oh, terrible yeah. flu. Yeah. On this one day, I just remember hearing the Queen song and thinking, "Oh, you'll tell me when you need me," and thinking I've been there for about five minutes. You slept for five hours. Yeah, I did. And then we'd all, uh, at some point in the afternoon, we all looked at each other and said, "Come on." We should. We all stroked your hair at one point. It was so kind of you not to wake me. I Let's get out of here. And then Nick drew a beard on you. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. With that permanent marker. <laughs> that, that's that old, that's yeah. in New Cross, but that's in Finchley, in Barnet. Right? That's New Cross. Finchley Barnet New Cross. One thirty-six <laughs> over twenty. <laughs> Finchley Barnet New Cross. Finchley Barnet New Cross. <laughs> Keep changing us. Oh, Look at that. That's a good. Look shot. at that. That is a lovely that shot. That was Millwall. That's New York. That Most of those are actually real zombies. Fuck you now. Here he is. And that wasn't Millwall. Me and Dylan having a little spat here. Dylan came up with the line or the word, the moniker for Sean, Captain Wow, which got us out of a tight spot. Thanks for that, Dylan. <laughs> what was it before? Uh, Sergeant Wow. I can't remember. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> I think it was called Colonel Amazing. Oh, Colonel, look, Colonel Gosh. He looks like a weird clown. Now, we got into trouble for being naughty, yeah, didn't is. we, this next... Oh, yeah. This next bit. This is Lucy's moment. You got into trouble. Take us through this, Lucy. Oh, just... No, hang on. What do you mean, take you? So just, just, just you want to do it. Talk about yourself a lot at length. I'm sure you're going to find it incredibly strenuous. Yeah, I've been doing it so, <laughs> so long. Um, what am I doing here? Teaching everybody zombies. You were all really sweet on that day, actually, because I looked at the sea of faces and you were all nodding and as if, like, you know, yes, you've got the lines right, well done. No, it's because oh. you were really good. You were very sweet. It was, you, you shouldered the entire film. <laughs> With a plum. Come on. Uh. Oh, fucking hell. <sighs> David's such a prick. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'll do it on the night. This is the night. I've got some good smoking acting. Mm. This is where we got the giggles really badly because yeah. you were yeah. doing your impression of Alan Hansen. <laughs> oh, it's funny. <laughs> I'm in the ham. I'm in the ham. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Okay. Um, Two, three. <gasps> now, this was yeah. the first day at New Cross. You, Kate, you, you always had a, quite a problem with the zombies, didn't you? You always actually found oh, them yes, slightly frightening. Oh, yes, I did find them frightening. They came really close to us. And you used to actually genuinely go, <laughs> Get away! <laughs> Kate, do you remember that zombie? And he'd um, got these huge staples. Oh, yeah. All the way up his arm. Oh, but Staple s- Johnson. Yeah, and staples <laughs> everywhere in his body. But it had recently had a motorbike accident. Yeah, he's... And they scraped him. He is there. And some of them have scraped off. Oh, no, poor man. Oh, God. There's the Italian twins. zombie, that guy. There's the twins. There's Liz, our friend Liz. Those twins are weird, aren't they? No, <laughs> not at all. <laughs> <laughs> what, because they look the same? And they were covered in blood, <laughs> approaching you. <laughs> what, what? What? I think it was more the denim than the look. They were really... I love the twins. They were, they were fantastic and really uh, 
up for it right it's to the point. the least unnerving when they finish each other's sentences as you're talking to them <laughs> and they're covered in blood. <laughs> when they came to do the reshoots, they were well up for doing some stunts. Were they? Oh, uh, yeah, they, they got hit by... Uh, I've seen a little clubs. letter from, from them in Heat magazine. Really? really? Yeah, saying we, we are the zombie twins. Really? Yeah. Thanks, oh. for, thanks for showing our picture. No way. Hello? Oh. Two seconds. Fuck, I still got it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Is that your teeth? Yeah. <laughs> I hate it when you hit your teeth or something. Ow! Uh. I love the fact you just describe a zombie apocalypse as slightly weird. You fuck off! Fuck, fuck fucking off! off. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's a, there's, there's a reprise no. of Look at Me quite a lot. Of, and there's, Ed says it to Sean in the pub. Sean says it to Ed outside the pub, and Liz says it to Sean when she's trying to stop him from uh, going crazy about David wanting to kill his mum. There's Scarlett at the front. She uh, uh, was a zombie. She a kiwi. Yeah. There's the guy there. That was the guy with the arms with the with the with the corn rolls, the gothy guy. Oh, wow. I think they're actually pronounced corn rolls. <laughs> corn rolls. <laughs> what did you say? Corn rolls. Corn rolls is sashimi. No sushi. <laughs> Dylan, what was it like chucking a bin through a windy? Before the actual take. <laughs> a windy. It was like being 15 again. Um. Well, you know, you would do things like that at 15. You'd throw a. I spent a night. I spent a night in the cells once for doing that. Did you? Okay. Yeah. You didn't. How old are you? Uh, 28. <gasps> <laughs> no, it's now. It's actually past the age when you're supposed to perfect a bin throw. <laughs> I know. There they all go. It's hard to believe, but there they do. They're smile, smiley, smile. They're smiley. Did you put some outtakes on the DVD? Yes. What about you when you were there going, oh? Yeah, when they all scared me. Yeah, oh, bollocks! You. you can see Michael Smiley in the crowd who plays Tyres in Space, who's dressed as Tyres, who's supposed to be Tyres as a zombie. And that's one for the Spaced fans. Dong. Of which many came along and were zombies, and big thanks to them for that, because they were the best. I like, I like, sorry, I like this shot a lot, because we all had to hide behind the camera as it was spinning round. Oh, uh, yeah. Didn't we? Because it was a 360. It was a 360, yeah. and then they had to... Yeah, and the lens then was a special... <laughs> Wasn't it an Ariflex long? It was an, an Ariflex long 58 oh, I've got a show at the Palace Theatre. <laughs> <laughs> Hobbits have two breakfasts. I, went, I was at uh -huh. home this day because I was so tired. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I, in this scene, I, I, was in, I was incredibly tired. It was all the acting. That's what it was that got me. This is your moment of horror. Oh. Look at you taking control <clears throat> in your leather jacket. I think I may order another bottle of wine. It's fine, isn't it? No. Yeah, I suppose. No, Harry Potter and the <laughs> cappuccino, yes. <laughs> 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 Who did that, you twat? I love that line. Who did that, you twat? You twat? I was genuinely at home on this day, lying in the back garden asleep. Really? Yeah. No, you were. I hadn't you slept were the so day before. Ill. I was really sick and I couldn't yeah. lift my head and it was fortunately... So you're not in every shop. My body knew that I could have a break on this day because I wasn't in the scene, so I went home. I love the way that, that he then goes to speak to Liz after yeah, that and yeah. your face is just yeah. like, oh, yeah, it's yeah. wounded. It sounds like very, oh, oh, very Irish to me now. It sounds like some kind of... What are we going to do? You are Irish. I know, I know, but it's just sometimes when you hear it, it sounds like a kind of angry news agent. <laughs> <laughs> is it just me or is it sweltering in here? It's really hot, it's but we have to turn the aircon off when yeah. we're, we're recording. Pop your top off. <laughs> <laughs> it's not an audition. Nick. <laughs> I love the way you rub your nose and you go, what then? And you do a, a, a really manic nose rub. Yeah, apparently the Americans are very excited about that. Your nose rub. Are they? Yeah. Very big on L.A. You're like the nose rubbing king. So this is this is my second favourite line of yours. You're okay. angry, can't you? When you go, don't make the best of it. <laughs> <laughs> That's brilliant. What's the first favourite? Second favourite. My other favourite is at the end. I'll point that out at the end. Your fa my favourite. My favourite Dylan is coming up. My favourite Dylan line is, I'm not going out there. Huh. And then that nose rub. Lucy, what? yours is coming up. What's mine? I think you look is when you cute as a button. You go nuts at the no, end. No, I think it's cute as a button. Pickle. Oh. 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 oh, cheesy. And Nick's look is even <laughs> cheesier. Check upstairs. I think it's locked. What's the phone situation? I like it when you get hit in the head with a dart. Yeah, look, this is my <laughs> yeah. favourite. Yeah. It's very good. Look. Oh, you're so cheeky there. Oh. oh What's that? I'm promised, didn't I? 
Oh. Look, I almost yeah. troubled with that. <laughs> I almost troubled with doing that because it was so corny. I know. Hmm. Promise or no? <laughs> That's true, we did, yeah. <laughs> and we always used to laugh because it was just like, oh. And then offering up a pig gonad. <laughs> <laughs> What stopped you? No, we cut that line out. What, what you want? What stopped you? You went and smashed oh. the window. You see that in the deleted scenes, actually. So I didn't like doing that bit. I, I got, a, I got, a, felt addicted to non-alcohol weird. beer during this. A peanut. This scene was really cut down. Yeah. This is really long. Was Stop it? Beeping, Lucy. <laughs> Sorry. Was it really long? Just yeah, because it went over that whole thing where you fancy a game of pool, and they probably just never. Uh, ball release and all that stuff. Is that gone? I'm just listening. That's all gone. It is, come on. Look at, look at David smart, really sulking. He's so <laughs> annoyed. The, the, the thing I really oh, like It's about not it. sulking, it's smouldering a la early Humphrey Bogart. I beg your pardon. <laughs> the thing well, I really job. liked about... Uh, pointed out. The thing I really liked about David's character is that... Uh, where? Some wine has arrived. Oh. Is that most of the time, <laughs> in fact, all the time, David's actually right, even though he's an insufferable know it all. Yeah, he genuinely is right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> some more wine. I have a little wine. Thing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, beautiful. Oh, this is the bit where you discover Hitler Skellington. I, I think, uh, I, I think, uh, Dylan, I like. I think you're a very good reactive actor as well as an actor. I like the way well, you respond. Sound, I'm delighted you say that because I'm doing a new dance piece in the round, which is just me but and a I dead like, fox. You do a lot of stuff when you're being just, you know, when you're not necessarily speaking. I'm just saying, I'm paying you a compliment. You like the bit where I'm quiet. Yeah, <laughs> especially when you, your voice really grates. <laughs> Oh now we've pointed this out, but that's Paul K there, my sister behind him, and Jeffrey uh, oh, yeah. yeah. Archer, Jeffrey Archer, uh, Lenny Bennett. Is Paul's little boy there? Yeah, Paul. Yeah, in that is, shot. Uh, Jordan as well. Yeah, Paul's son. He's a lovely little lad, and apparently he's afraid of volcanoes. Oh, Why wouldn't he? you be? That's a little phobia. Lucy, I think you look sensational there. <laughs> turning on my, doing my turning over telly act. You're turning on a lot more than the telly, oh, Lucy. Oh, Simon, <laughs> help me. You can tell he's the writer. <laughs> <laughs> Discovery, E4, Bravo. Sometimes in Lizzie's eyes, I think she thinks maybe I'm with the wrong mate. Yeah, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. <laughs> you know what I'm she saying? really wants to be with Ed. I like the way that you when she, when you when she when you, you oh I can't speak. No, don't. I like it when you go. There's not much on TV, is there? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> they haven't spoken about the huge uh, homoerotic surtext. Surtext. As well as the subtext. <laughs> yes. There is a homoerotic subtext yeah. in between Ed and Sean and oh, obviously yeah, Dave, David and Sean more than anything. David, Sean, Ed, David, Sean, Ed We could Sean. have a three-way soggy Please. biscuit off. They want to do a circle jerk. It's all about to hell. Look, get off me. <laughs> yeah, you want to hit me then. Feeling Ed's massive power. Oh dear. Oh, they come. Here they come. Are we coming up for the Queen bit now, aren't we? switch off the TV then? Um, noise, and also because Edgar told me. <laughs> Is that all? Yeah. Okay, it's good enough. Yeah, we're coming up to the Queen fight now. What do the zombies mean in your film? my favourite bit. What? What did you say? Do you remember Edgar <laughs> used to, Edgar wanted us to rehearse the Queen fight in lunchtime. Yeah. And we were so oh. fucking hungry and tired and Edgar, we didn't want Edgar. to. And he was like, he insisted. Here it comes. Oh. I can listen to it now and not weep. We used to have, we had these, little, we had these things in our ears. Do you remember what were they called? Nodules, widgets, or something. Wongos, yeah. blanchets. Which kept being blasted. Do you remember the little mm. tiny? Look like hearing yeah. aids. Yeah. What do you mean? Big, we got ragging. Lights it. Woof. God, we went. We, we, when we first choreographed this sequence, it took us an entire day. I like it when you stand up. And there were loads of bits when they were like unscrewing the half cues and. I know, but it doesn't really look like that, does it? Now when no. you see it. But you remember you had a whole sort of kung fu bit which we cut out. Yeah. Oh, that's right. It's quite funny that after dispatching the zombies earlier on in various ways, yeah. throwing records or spades, you decide to slowly beat one to <laughs> death <laughs> with focus. But he's supposed to be like a kind of uber lord. <laughs> The end of level That's boss. Great. I like that bit. Yeah, he's like a yeah. boss. Look, there he goes. Action man, straight across to the back. See, we're doing a whole routine there, but you're not on us. Yeah, yeah. Look, he's I like, think we were told that at the time. Nilly. Clack, <laughs> clack, clack. <laughs> we could have stopped. Yeah, but we no. We were so knackered. 
Now the cues we were using were sort of rubber, but they kept breaking, didn't they? Do you remember we had to? Yeah. They kept holding up the shot yeah. because the cues kept breaking. It was so annoying. But the art—I mean, the art department were amazing. But it's very hard to make a long, thin club without it breaking. Oh, what was her name? Phyllis. Look at that. Phyllis. Yeah, Phyllis <laughs> McMahon. Very good. Who played Bernie? Bernie and John are based on real people that were. Um, Bernie and John. Bernie and John, who run the Shepherds. On here we go. Kate, go. Oh, oh, that's it. Oh, it's blown. <laughs> Oh. That's the ejaculate. Oh, God. <laughs> this is now, these are CG darts, actually, that you see flying through the air. Aren't they on wires? Oh, One of them was on a wire, but the actual, that in the middle of the shot is a CG dart. And this one, that I is a CG dart. I was good at my throwing. Dart. And that was a real dart in my head. I love the no. way you look through your eyes, though. <laughs> 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 oh, you know. <laughs> I, love the, look. <laughs> I love the way I can, I can sense your little legs really pummeling on the ground as you push him in. <laughs> Now, look at Ed, look at the composition of the shot there. Edgar Wright, you've got to hand it to the little bastard. Yeah. Who? <laughs> he's, Whoa. A, he's a clever boy. I could have had an eye out. I hate that line, too aggressive, I think, from me. I fucking knew it. Okay. Huh. Under, under, undermines your earlier gentle work. Yeah. <laughs> CG blood. Look, we're just about to see 11, 11, 11 on the time code. Bang. There we go. That means something. Okay, has anyone fired a gun before? Oh, yes. Apart from Ed. I'm going pass. Now we lost your line about Leah oh, here, yeah. but it's I in the deleted realize. scenes. Yeah. How do you feel about that? How do you say the deleted scenes? <laughs> <laughs> it was it was it was absolutely brilliant, yeah. but uh, we had to speed sure. it up. And we lost next line as well. <laughs> <laughs> Look at me like that. <laughs> <laughs> that was a real cut. No, it wasn't. Was? Huh? I cut my eye for real. Did you? Oh, were you tired? Yeah. <laughs> My eye was so Your tired. Your skin was open. tired. <laughs> I definitely want to come in. That's my second favorite of yours. I definitely want to come in. Let's get into our jammers. And into our normal clothes. Hello. Hello. Now, you had your eye split here. Oh, what? Sorry. Your eye cut. Do you remember we decided oh, yeah. that you were going to get at least some wounding on you. Yes, I'd like, I like I I wanted more, didn't I? Know, I know, I know, but you know, Jane wouldn't do it. <laughs> Jane Walker, who's our makeup designer, who's absolutely amazing. Mm -hmm. Worth quickly saying. And lovely Candice. And Candice Banks, who Candice is Spanks. Her, Candice Banks. Jane and Candice who are our main makeup people and then uh, there was a flotilla of uh, makeup <coughs> artists beneath her. I know that's the wrong word. It's not. Um but um she didn't want to put too much blood on Liz because she wanted Liz to remain Sort of um, spotlessly beautiful rather than plasmaed right. up. Yeah. Spotlessly beautiful. You've got some nice. Uh, you've got a little bit of plasma on you as well. You got, the girls got end. They wanted to keep the girls beautiful rather than. Yeah, fake tanned. But you had a nice splat. Don't yeah. say that. How could it be fake? How could it be? It comes off in the rain. Hemoglobin, what's your level? <laughs> That's my level. 16. That's your level. <laughs> 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 this took quite a long time to shoot, didn't it? Yeah. yeah. Fucking ages. That's uh, ages, yeah. And this is this is where I got my burn in that's, this shot. Oh, yeah. One of the spent shells came mm. out and burnt Lucy's face. Yeah. I hate spent shells. I hate them. <laughs> I bloody hate Keeps spent right shells. There's <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sarah Mooney getting a shot to the head. Good shot. Didn't Dee Dunlap say it was one of the best he'd ever seen? Since Goodfellas. Since uh, Samuel Goodfellas. L. Jackson got shot. There it is. Bang. Bang. With a bit of CG in the front, and Lawrence and Tim at the other door. I didn't get to fire the gun once. This is when the film no, gets, takes a dark turn, really. So oh, it's not all bad. Where it becomes a metaphor for the new Europe. Correct. That's <laughs> <laughs> exactly what it is. Some people haven't really taken. Some, some, the people that haven't um, have any complaints about the film, of which there are very few. Mm. So the, the, the end, uh, the, this bit actually, the tone, the change in tone is quite sort of sudden and, and affecting. And what, I remember when we happened? first tested it when Barbara dies. You. <laughs> I like it though. I, I love it. Because Penelope does such an amazing job. It's the death of John the Baptist. See, look, Ed and Liz again. They're quite touchy feely. Huh. Well, they are kind of, you know. Mm. Friends. Obviously, having an affair behind Shaw's back. <laughs> um. That was done afterwards. We put that line in later. Oh, no. oh, I hate she spasms. It just. Oh, God, stop it. Oh, ever decreasing Barbara. 
this was a tough day. Do you remember Penelope's told yeah. it, told the, the, the told Edgar to try and um, you know hurry it along, hurry it along because yeah. it was difficult. To deal with her? You're very good here, Dylan. Nice. Well, my hair is very good because it's, it <laughs> makes you think he's a prick. Edgar always wanted you to be like uh, Dustin Hoffman in, um, in Straw, Straw Dogs, Dogs yeah. but you, yeah, it's, this, I think I really, I've got to say, everybody is, in this sequence is very, very good. And I was, I'm very proud to have worked oh. with you all. Oh, I think I shout a bit too much. much. Apart from Kate. What? what? Oh. That's my favourite. That's my other favourite line of yours. Is what does that mean in the middle of that awful moment? Please, can we just stop and think about this? You don't shout too much. No, it's not in real life. Uh, this is, shouting, this is, this is really. I think this is a really good sequence. So. It's genuinely schizophrenic because it's funny and it's awful and it's uh, sad and it's. Oh, it's a whole bunch of exposition. <laughs> bang, 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 bong. <laughs> And I, I think it's I think it's funny because it's like a parody of exposition. Yeah, absolutely. And also the the absurdity of the face-off being with two bottles and a corkscrew and a gun. And this is the look. Oh, he speaks to Liz. Look at her. Diane's eyes. It's like heartbreak. Pickle. Daffs and Pickle are both pet names that have been used on Edgar in the past. <laughs> true. Are they? Yeah, true. They suit him. Yeah, he is a Daffy Daffs. Pickle. <laughs> it's true. I never really came across really that, that Diane, David and Liz were all teachers together. No, I don't we think kinda, I clicked onto that. We kind of cut a lot of the details out. That, that There you go, look, bang. Okay. Thank you, Elizabeth. Yeah. Twat. <laughs> oh, God, everyone's so charged up. Uh, John, look at me. This is hard, isn't it? This is a tough couple of days, isn't it? It's like the audition sequence for fame. Don't just look at me. I'm like Leroy, you're like Coco. <laughs> I want to be Mr. Sharofsky. <laughs> you always go with the be. hair. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, look. Here she comes. <laughs> Who is it? <laughs> Bloody mum. Oh, look at her. Penelope's my, f uh, apart from, aside from you, at the end, is my favourite zombie in zombie movie history. That is, that's quite nice. Uh, she's got some CGI eyes in there, or CGI eyes, I like to call it. <laughs> this guy's always on. <coughs> it's pretty fucking uh, awful, isn't it, really? Well, no, not really. Well, you know, if you come up on the second half, you looked in, I had a bang and got one in, one nil. <laughs> bang. <Whoa>. Oh. <laughs> Was that CGI on the back of the head? Yes, it was. Because you remember that was an, that was a stunt woman. That was after Penelope had oh, left that's us. Right. Yeah. And we pulled a, like a crash mat from underneath her, and she fell back. She's quite a high trouser, didn't she? <laughs> <laughs> Did she? Yeah, quite high. You could. I wasted. See the water look recovery. At, look, at all, look at the look at the look. <laughs> Bang! I like everybody there because everyone's sort of breathing really hard and <laughs> click. Bang. You do actually try to he shoot. He was going. Yeah, you would shoot him. In. That's the thing. That's outrageous. If that yeah. had a bullet in you it. You deserve to die you for don't. that, really. Well, somebody, Edgar was saying yesterday, someone had said David didn't really deserve to get torn to pieces, but then he did no, try he and shoot he, he would have shot you. He would have shot. Very. Here we go. There you go, Vincent oh. Shavers. I felt so sorry for you. Her little nose was red and she was really stuffy. <laughs> yeah. What about my little nose? Yeah, it's red and stuffy, <laughs> sure. Yeah, but for a different reason. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry, Diane. Now, we actually cut... We, we, you'll see in the deleted scenes that David actually does apologise to Sean, but in the edit, Edgar thought it was better that he never quite got to say sorry and so never redeemed himself before this. This is quite incredible, really, isn't it? I've only ever mm, seen it up to yeah. here. You haven't. Your react, your, your, both your reactions were completely real here, weren't they? Because it was the first time you'd seen the effect. Mm. Oh, they're genuinely Random. screaming in horror. Your mum was there too, Lucy, wasn't she? Yeah, so, so, yeah where's your mum? <laughs> I can see guts. my mum's friend and then my mum's behind her. I think in this scene, one of my favourite zombies is Paul Putner. Oh, there Look, he is. His face is shaking, he's eating so much haemoglobin. I love Look. the fact no. that it becomes so pliable. I know, yeah. They just bite off your arms and legs. <laughs> 
Lucy hitting uh, Julianne there. God. Well, that's Diane gone and David gone. Bye bye. Bye bye, guys. Thanks for everything. But yeah. Diane actually survives. If you look at the plot holes, you'll see how she got away. This ending was a lot bigger in the script. Yeah, I was going to actually do something really cool. Yeah, what were you have like a gun? hoverboard. I was going to mm. hit the um, motor oh, that right. was on me, wasn't I? You were going right. to smash his visor and gonna shoot into it. You were yeah. going to smash the visor and then spin the, spin the gun. gun around and then shoot his face off. <laughs> but I didn't get to do it. Oh. Yeah, the hat stand. I, think, oh, I, think I, that, I remember writing that and thinking that was going to be real cool and we never got to do it just because of time and, you know. I could sense Pete's giant hog all throughout this scene. Oh, Nick. <laughs> now, that's a fake arm right there. That's not uh, a real arm. No, it's not. Tell, tell us about Bukaki Phyllis. Uh, well, I basically came blood all over her gob and she froze. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> Bang. Ooh. That is a good day. Phyllis, uh, who plays uh, Bernie, got a blood squirt right in her eye. But bless her, carried on acting. <laughs> Don't make uh. that noise. And uh, there's a take when she's just covered in blood. Over there the you bar, go. we jumped over the bar. This is the love scene. Been and gone. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> that was the romantic in bit in the rom com We actually did. We wrote in the in the first original script. There was a when Liz and Sean went up in the lift. They had a big snog as they went up in the lift, and we decided to not do it because we decided to never uh, be sort of conventional and never get to that kind of like strings and violence. And you're moment. afraid of girls anyway. And I'm trying to pay. <laughs> See, I always thought instead That's of smashing that bottle on the bar, you should have smashed it on someone's head. Oh, shut up. Well, I just thought it was a shame. That's all. Missed opportunity. Thank you, Kate. What, the snog or the smash? The smash. <laughs> the snash. The snosh. Cool, blimey, it's hot. Look at it's, isn't it? This was yeah. in the very last days of the pubs, I mean, when, we, when we could literally burn it down. Oops. Bang! Oh. Eat that. That's a great dad. Yeah. Do you remember when we were doing that scene, there was all that rubber broken glass all over the floor and it was oh, just getting in everyone's eyes and hands and, and in your trousers yes. and all. Oh. It, uh, it would just crystallise. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it was amazing. It was horrible. What? The trousorial aspect? You got, I, we, everyone had like uh, bits of broken rubber glass in their underwear because it was just... Mm. It was like weird, invasive powder. This was near the very end that we actually did this bit, wasn't it? This was near your last day. It was the second <laughs> studio we moved into, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Because then we moved into the flat and that was when you left and when Penelope left. This has got a, got a good There's morning. There's a big cheesy bit here, but it doesn't look so bad on this somehow. Do you remember? With the lighter. Oh, yeah, yeah, you didn't like doing that, did you? <laughs> I think we asked, we, we asked a lot of you to try and do all this exposition in one facial expression. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> but it doesn't look so bad no, when we all. see no, it. No, you did it brilliantly. It's fantastic. Mm. I had so much corn syrup in my undies. Did you? <laughs> sticky, sticky. Okay. Did it glue your bollocks to your leg? This is BBC Radio 4. Yeah, it did. <laughs> and the shipping yeah, it did. <laughs> it was weird in a way, because in some respects it was like actually shooting the film was similar to the film because we would lose people along the way like when Dylan and Lucy left I remember we went to the pub that evening and it was a, it was a, it was a, it was genuinely sad because we you know we'd yeah. worked really hard on the film I don't want to be cheesy but True. you know we were losing people along Bring the way Bring me I'm ready Bring me <laughs> <laughs> and it was sad to see you guys go and it felt weird when you left because it felt like it was there was something missing ah, forget it anyway yeah, I know. Fucking the you. you're right <laughs> That's my favourite line of yours. And I'll be back up if I do it as hell. Don't be no Bob Windsor. Yeah. Clack. Oh, you're it's classic crying peg. There, classic peg. Classic peg. I think. Uh, I think a lot of it was to do with the fact that I was so tired. I was crying all the time. What? <laughs> you know what I think it was? I think it was the acting. I think that's what got you. <laughs> it was some of the acting. Yeah. Actually. Oh, we're not shot. I love that line. I like that too. Thanks, Kate. <sighs> Do you think I am the Robbie Coltrane for the noughties? Mm. Easy. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Should See, this is the bit I mean. If Hagrid was a drug dealer. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. 
Harry, <laughs> Harry Potter and the Rap of Smack. Do you know anything about the Chamber of Smack? <laughs> <laughs> Harry Potter and the Dazzling White Light. <laughs> There it is, there it is. Yes, exactly. There you go. Wind back and see Kate's reaction. We had to, we asked Kate to shoulder the entire film for one second in finding their way out. Hmm? There he is. Mm. Hmm? I think this is one of the greatest pieces of acting you've ever done, Nick. Oh. What are you talking it's obvious then, you never saw that. Pizza, that's what I did. <laughs> no. The way you shake your head, that's it. Don't bother, make it don't fucking it. bother. Go. Go. It's like the, the beer hunter. <laughs> <laughs> Are you falling asleep there, Lucy? Uh, a little bit hot. Lucy just yeah. got back from America this morning. America? From America. America. And hasn't been to sleep and has come along very, very sweetly. <laughs> I am sweet. We're only a little bit from the end and we can stick the air conditioning on. It's yeah. really hot in this room, isn't it, yeah. guys? Yeah, I'd like to take my top off. I'm starting off to feel drowsy with it. Trust me, enjoying yourself. Switched on. Oh, God, God. That is funny. Quite a rude <laughs> fart joke at the end. Ah, oh. some Here come the Belgians. Thank you. The Belgians are playing their joker. <laughs> um, this is a very sad moment, don't you think, everybody? Yes, I do, Simon. What, when it dies? Well, they have to say it goodbye. doesn't die, though, really. Morbin Cheban. Morbin Cheban. I like dying in things. <laughs> you like dying in things? Yeah. I like that big chain. Cheers. <coughs> Look, bye Ed, love you. What does that say? <coughs> <coughs> Bang. The chain was a good weapon, wasn't it? Yes, When I you started like it. swinging it at the end. Now this is, a, uh, this is my, I think, one of my favourite shots in the film. Edgar couldn't use all of it because it didn't work, but this crane shot as the camera pulls away is just, is mm. Edgar at his acest, I think. Crane? Look, it, it, but it went back even further and further, but some of the zombies Between weren't the looking zombies. so good. Yeah, yeah, it just looks so great. And here we are. I will, I'm not in this bit Months now. later. Now there's Kate there, that's Shepperton. This is all Shepperton. That's New Cross. This is Shepperton. That's Shepperton. Shepperton. That's, that's New Shepperton. <laughs> that's Corin there. Lucy Atkins from Space. Joe Cornish from Adam and Joe. This Adam is all stuff that Apple and Joe. We picked all this up later on to beef up the ending because we didn't get the shots when we needed them. Is uh, Jessica beating up the twins? They're creepy, aren't they? Look, boom, boom. They're not stunt guys, but they just decided they were going to go for it. Lovely fellas. Yeah. Good guys. Part of the family. God bless them. Tag along. So just the two of you? That was really late at night, wasn't it? Yeah, it was we early in the morning. Yeah, no, Sad, it was like three or four in the morning. Two of us. I know. And there's also the implication that Yvonne's not got her... We were going to do a bit when you saw in the news footage if all Yvonne's family were still alive and it was like, you know... Sean had just fucked it up for everybody. Oh, is Rob Brydon doing the uh, Zombies from Hell voiceover? Because that works so effectively, doesn't it, the air conditioning? Oh, yeah. Being funny? No, I'm just saying oh. you can really feel <laughs> okay. the difference already. That's Edgar. That was one of the very first makeup tests that we did. Yeah, yeah I remember that. And uh, Ronaldo yeah. Vasconcelos, our line producer. Those little bits were directed by Jeremy Lovering, who's a director and uh, the director of Killing Hitler, yes. which Kate was in. Is he dead? And also, here's a weird fact, as I said earlier on, but the priest on the TV at Philip and Barbara's, as Coldplay, uh, is Jeremy's dad. Yes, that's true. Chris Martin and Johnny Buckland from Coldplay, and there's uh, Noel, who was the guy in the shop earlier on. Rafe. Here's, that's uh, Charles Jennings, who is uh, the director of, uh, <laughs> and Nick, uh, the dire uh, director and producer of Hitchhiker's Guide. There's Sam, who did an amazing job on Trisha, who was yeah. genuinely upset when people were laughing. I because love Trisha. You got a bed with it? And this was... This wasn't your last scene, was it? Because the last scene you did was the one when we did... It was part of the plan. This was like your second from last scene. <laughs> part of the plan? Yeah, you know, we did the bit when we sat on the sofa. Oh, yes, the... that's right. <laughs> yes, but this is my last day. This is your last day. <laughs> no. You say goodbye to Kate. What's so funny? He's doing his... He's doing his I'm cute I'm just scratching Labrador myself for the girl. <laughs> <laughs> For the benefit of people watching, <laughs> Nick scratching his neck. Uh, 
You've got a nice Mooks t-shirt on there. I'm packing a, uh, I think it might be a duffer, I'm not sure. And here's for it. True love. Gets to have a life. Oh, I really do. If you know. notice in the background, there's a shrine to David, Diane, and Ed, and Barbara, that. and if you wind back oh, on the I'm shelf, there's that. pictures of everybody. Because oh, we don't know that but, that uh, Diane's still alive at no, this point. No, we will when we do Sean's visit. Yeah. Two, just from Dustil Sean. Mm. Hang on, what's he doing in the shed? I oh, better turn the what's volume up. Gone to get the Fison's grow back. Wait a minute. Grrr. Oh, there we are. <laughs> He's still trying to eat everything. Isn't he? <laughs> you make a fantastic zombie, Nick. Oh, yeah. Thanks. I actually made Nick up as a zombie in 1994 to go to a Halloween party in Cricklewood. Did you? Yeah, yeah. It's such, I mean, it's a White very, trash very moving gay love story. <laughs> really. About two guys. Yeah, yeah it is. No. Like well, you know, it's, a, it's not a bad film. I've seen worse. <laughs> okay, your final thoughts. I liked it. Enjoyed it? Did you yes, have a good time? Yes, I did, thank you. Nick? Uh, what a pleasure. Lucy? It's like a romantic comedy with zombies. Just say something you know. <laughs> <laughs> I did. You had fun, right? I had a brilliant time. Dylan? An awakening for you, really. I had a great time, and uh, you know, the terrible thing about saying that is that it's—it's it's it's, not true. <laughs> no, it is. It's true. That's the thing. That's the really boring thing about it. I had a great time. It was a good time. Filming it is one of my best jobs. Every day it was like bashing zombies with driftwood or doing car stunts, or it was brilliant. I loved it. It was good for us because yeah, it was well, like it was our sort of you know we'd been working on it for such a long time, and then to get the um, you know. Yeah. Yeah. to get you guys and, and it'd be such fun all the time as well. What great. lens are you using right now? I'm mm. using my my, my soppiest lens of all. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel Mudford and Pete Woodhead, great great score from them. Yes. Tina, Tina J. J. Thanks very much. Yes. Inside Track. Lovely, I Gina. love Inside Track. I, Inside love, track I only work with them. Film four. Film four. Gina I mean, J, of course, who fought Kate for a long time. We said, I always said we want Kate. Actually, physically. Like, no way. We don't want to. <laughs> what? No. Really. Here's the roller. Let's have a look who's on here. Bill Robert Fitch. Nye. I oh, that's Robert. Robert. Who's Bill. the distressed man who is Robert Fitch? Himself, himself. Who's that? Herself, Carol Barnes, Rob, Rob, Rob Butler. Butler. Jeremy Thompson. Chris Jeremy Martin. Thompson. Chris I like Martin. that guy. Uh, guy Berryman, who was the bassist of Coldplay, was supposed to uh, be in that sequence as well, but he couldn't find his way to Channel 4 because he lost his mobile. Uh, so we stepped in. So we stepped in, which you'll see on the deleted scene, on the extras. Susie Gordon. Pam uh, Beaver was the shortest the woman in show business. <laughs> see you later, <laughs> <laughs> I think we can probably stop talking. No, we've got to talk to the very end. To the very end you of can the go thing. You Yeah. What? I don't want you to go, Dylan. Who's Fat Boy Smith? <laughs> <laughs> Fat Boy Slim's brother. Okay, well, all that remains to say is thank you to everybody. I'm going to take your rickle around. Sweet. That would take be polite. Take your rickle out and shoulder this myself. It's like her. Thanks to everybody that worked on Shaun of the Dead, to everybody that you see rolling up in front of you now, all of whom. There's Ben Greaves there, one of the fantastic part of our sign department, Arthur. I love SD, Simon I Hayes. love SD. SD, sound department forever. <laughs> Lisa Bixler, a choreographer. Thanks to everyone who, who made it possible and helped me and Edgar out in putting the film on the screen and thanks to you for buying the DVD. And um, and, and that's it. And I've that's got so a lot of love for everyone in the room. Mm. I'm like Darius Dinesh. Have you seen that picture of him with his cock out? <gasps> No. It's very funny. Uh, I have to leave the room. There's too much love in it. I can't deal with why it. Has he got, it's why like has his he got big helmet keeper. It's a, there's a picture of him with a kilt on, and he's, he's, he's got yes, a Yes, that's Tyler Barber Tompkins in there, isn't it? It's hilarious. It up. To to hilarious. Yeah, I think. Well, so don't talk about if you're still watching, Darius is keep watching Darius. because and read the credits because everyone here is a very important person. Yeah. Except, CIP. except, 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 except for pick somebody. Except for except for Darren. Who was one oh. of the grips who just did nothing? No, he didn't. Just a kid. I'm a kid. I'm a kid. All right. I only McKittrick did fuck all. I remember that. Oh, that's it. And what about Oscar Wright, Edgar's brother? What oh, did he do? What nothing. A jerk off. He just got in everyone's way. Is it Edgar's way. brother? Yeah. Oh. He did all the graphics. Graphic schmaffics. And then there's uh, there's that, and there's that person there, and so bye. Everyone say bye. 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 Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, everyone. Bye. Bye. Bye, Thank everyone. Bye. 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 And we cut there. And we cut there. And no, we keep Message going. Messages. We we'll just stay to the end. <laughs> oh, no, we don't. Message Do we have because if you stay to the very end, there's a prize. I'm going to tell everyone where there's a, a golden rabbit buried. <laughs>
And if they get, if they stay to the end and read all the credits, anybody who stays in the cinema, though, they to can watch dig the up the golden the rabbit. But I'm not going to say where it is oh. until the end. In France, rabbit is called lapin. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> There's oh. all the music. You can get that on the soundtrack if you go and buy the soundtrack. So Ooh. in Sex in the City, it was called Le, look, Le Lapin en Look, is, your, is Christina on here? My Christina. Mom and my sister on Who? Here. Look, Jill and Katie. Oh, my Peck, fiance. There. Dolby Digital <laughs> Surround. Okay. Tough times for me. So if you've watched the whole <laughs> film with the commentary, you've got a chance now to win a very expensive prize. One valued at approximately two and a half thousand pounds. One is of a golden rabbit. Lucy Davis's teeth. <laughs> which I have buried somewhere in Britain. So uh, if you want to score the prize of a lifetime, Kill make you, your way now to number four, Westwood Park, <laughs> which is situated just north of 